EA Sports. It's in the game. Hey guys and welcome back to the Retro Show. In today's episode we will be playing EA Sports Cricket 2000 on the PS1. I'm Joe if you're new around here. Make sure you do subscribe to Captain Goodspeed Retro if you want to see regular retro content. Well, the, the test uh, finished yesterday against India or maybe earlier. I don't know. I'm recording this in advance, so I thought we'd do some cricket today. We'll do the World Cup, I guess. That, that might, oh, it's Super 6. Why not? We'll do the Super 6. We'll be uh, England. Um, so Actually, no, we don't want to swap with anyone. Huh? Yeah, so we can, we can pick who we want to be. So we can't be India, Kenya, or... On New Zealand, which is interesting. Um, Bangladesh versus Scotland. I don't know why the cricketers are just walking. That's hilarious. Um, but this is a game that I've never played before. I've played 2002, 4, 5, and 7 uh, of EA Sports uh, as cricket. So uh, there's only five overs a match. I wonder why. Hold on. Is it in the game options, perhaps? Uh, uh, we can't we, we can't change that, but uh, very very interesting. We have already played uh, Cricket 07 in the retro show. If you check the playlist, which will pop up in the top right corner, um, then you'll see that we did that over on my main channel, Captain Goodspeed, um, until we we made a dedicated platform for this. So Australia versus Pakistan. Australia lost. Wow. But we're playing this match, England versus South Africa. Uh, and here is some of the team. So we can edit it. Um, uh, who's in, uh, in there? So it's Andrew Flintoff, is he in there? Hopefully he is. I don't know how we, how we change anybody. Um, I don't know, is it... Haven't got a clue, but Flintoff's in there. Chris Reed's in there as well. He's quite an old, old face. Nick Knight, Graham Hick, Nasser Hussein, of course. But uh, we are going to be playing as England in this match. Really don't know how this is going to go. Uh, quite basic controls though, which is good to see. Um, just X <laughs> and and moving the the the, uh, the the stick in the the right directions. Um, mm. So then it starts. So here we go. Let's get into it. England versus South Africa at Headingley. So uh, I don't know if there's any commentary or whatever in this match. I will have a little look on the on the back. Um, Rishi Benno and David Gower are in the commentary box for this one. And the pitch is damp. Well, that'll offer some encouragement to the bowlers. It's just a question, really as to whether or not conditions change through the day. And as it's so cold, I suggest they might stay very much the same. Okay, choose heads or tails. Um, tails, because tails never fails. Tossing the coin. And it is tails. We have won the toss. And uh, as everyone knows from my cricket captain stuff, I like chasing. So we're going to bowl first. Um, but yeah, the commentary sounded all right there. So... Who's going to bowl first? I think we're going to probably go um, get Darren Goff to open the ball. And... I'm surprised they've been put in. Yes, I don't think there's that much in this pitch this morning. Uh, they might get something, but not as much as they're hoping for, I think. There we go, the umpire's walking out. Now then, what are we doing? That is him. Well, that's four. That's annoying. They sound like South Africans. 
Yes, come on. Yes, yes. Uh, well, I mean, look at these graphics. Absolutely sensational. He's gone forward. Good shot. Oh dear, that's four as well. Oh, running towards the boundary. I wonder if we can simulate it all. I'm not sure we. Oh, generate result. Oh, man. You see, I don't want to generate the the whole result. I guess we'll just have to. So if we go into this, is the. What does that do? Nah, it's match results. Nah, we'll just have to to cope with it. Um, Jacques Callas. Goodness me. Uh, how do we? Can, there we go. I'm going to try and in swing it. Here's a glorious shot. They're not hitting it very well. We're hitting it well enough. Oh, we had a chance, eh? Well, he was out of his crease. Come on. Let's try and out swing it. Right at the 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 heels. Here's a wrecking shot. The the problem is that they just seem to be. Um, hitting everything away for runs, unfortunately. Oh, got a nice screen, man. Oh, example of batting would be a compliment. Go away, ice cream man. That is a glorious. Oh, that's a nice shot for four. Well played. And look at the umpire; he's loving it. He's loving it. Uh, end of the over. Let's bring Freddy in. See what he can do. Well, oh, that could be a no ball. Balanced himself quite perfectly. He played the stroke in magnificent style. Might be going for a third here. Unlucky. That was 13 off that first over. I don't think we're going to quite have these results. Balanced himself quite perfectly. Four. Played the stroke in magnificent style. Or is it? I think it might stop. Ooh, it's literally just stopped on the boundary. I think they probably are going to get four, though. Or did they only run three? Who knows? They did. Right, bouncer clock. I don't know what was in his mind when he went for that. There we go. Let's see how we do here. Outswing it. Well, that wasn't bad. Good old Freddie Flint offer. That is played to perfection by the batsman. How did he manage to hit that through the leg side? That makes zero sense. Balanced himself perfectly and got the stroke away. <sighs> I just want these overs to be over. And then we can get batten. I really don't know how we can do any any better than this. Well, we hit the stumps. At least we know we can hit the stumps. Um. Right. Caddock. Can come in. Let's bowl a full toss. See what happens with this. That is a glorious shot. Oh, they're coming back for three. This could be a run out. It is a run out. We get our first wicket. Gone. He's out. And he's gone. Yes. 
He does like that shot. I don't know how he keeps hitting it through the leg side. Oh, this could be another chance for a run out. Oh, they just about got there. Look at the batsman moving. <laughs> oh, dear. It'll be a compliment. Uh, to oh, it's out. Mediocre example of batting. He's gone. Two wickets down now for 30. South Africa struggling here. Come on. Now that's played to perfection. Oh, what a shot. That's six. Big wind up, and it was a big hit for six. We've gone for about 10 minutes so far. We'll go for about 20. Well, we'll that finish this match. That's shot. another great shot. And that's six again. That's a beautiful hit. It's flown right over the boundary for six. Uh, nothing you can do about that. The Lawton times are pretty, pretty fluid. Oh, that was a neat shot. Great to see. He was too expensive in that over. Oh, I think we've uh, pressed the wrong button. So Alex Stewart is now bowling. That was a neat shot. A big wind up and it was a big hit for six. Doesn't feel like Alex Stewart bowling though. Well, that's a cracking shot. I mean, they're they potentially going to have um, oh that was a chance for a run out there um, 70 odd runs from 5 overs which is going to be very difficult to that is a beat shot. That's an absolute cracker. What a wonderful stroke. I just don't get how they're playing leg side shots from such a wide delivery. So, fair to say, I don't know how to bowl well on this, but uh, hopefully we can have a bit of fun with the batting. Well, that, uh, That's out. Is, uh, well done. Would be a compliment. He's gone as well. Let's try and ball in that same area. Well, that's played to perfection by the batsman. Come on. Oof. He bowled too many balls that went for four and that over. Yeah, that's the cardinal sin. He didn't bowl to his field. And the batsmen were able to find the gaps all too easily. So final over. I'm not sure who's balling. Well, that is nicely played. But what is quite encouraging is that they seem to be able to get three runs on demand. So hopefully we can as well. <laughs> but uh, we we definitely are struggling with the the ball, and I'm just glad it's a five over match and not a fifty over match. Here we come, steaming in. That is a glorious nice. shot. Mm, nice shot. Well played. Well, that's a cracking shot. Uh, nothing we can do here. Here we go. Come on. 
I don't know what uh, that's out. thinking was there. I can't believe it. So we're going to need uh, something like 15 and over to win this match, which, you know, is, is doable, and hopefully we'll be able to pull it off. Well, that's a cracking shot. But, um... Definitely an interesting game. <laughs> Very difficult to ball on it. Um, but hopefully batting will be a little bit easier. So here we come. Uh, into the innings now. Wow. Oh no, what's he doing? Ah, oh, it's X to Bloomin' L. Deary me, right. This is hard. Oh, what? This is stupid. <laughs> you don't usually have to do that. Oh, no. It's going to ball us here. Um... We, we might be playing quite badly. No. But then again, we might not be. <laughs> oh dear, let me... Oh, this is just terrible. Oh. oh, how did... What? Did that hit the stumps? Flint offs out. We're not for four here. Come on, we need to get some runs. Oh. Well, that's one over gone. I don't I don't think we've got any chance of really doing anything here. How did that hit the stumps? Can we get bowled out for zero? That would that would be embarrassing. I don't I don't see what else I can do here. They were just going, yes. Yes, one more. I'm pretty close to getting Ah, we can walk down the wicket. I love it. Come on, we've got to at least get some runs. That's the target now. We're not gonna win this match, so. Oh no! Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, he's in. Oh no, he's not! Ah! <laughs> oh, this is just absolutely diabolical. So is... Is the thing on the top left the, the timing, perhaps? I don't know. Perhaps it is. Let's see. Yes, it is. There we go. Finally got used to it. Another one. Another. Here we go. We're going to get three runs. Brilliant running. Right then. So how many do we need? 72 off three over. So we need 24 and over. It's doable. Oh, stupid idiot. <sighs> Have you ever seen such a poor performance in cricket? No. Imagine if this happened to the real-life England team. It would be hilarious, but equally... A certain something would hit the fan. Pity. Can we at least get a boundary in this match, or, or survive the five overs? I'm not. Obviously, we're not going to win the match now, but no. the 
They're struggling to hit any sort of meaningful shot. Well, three overs gone, four for seven. And that's not in Australian money there. And just can't get the ball away. Feel like we're timing it well, but nothing's coming of it. Come on. Thought we had it there. Come on. I'm going to go for the cover drive. Yes. There you go. We might get some runs from this. Just come on. Good running. Six for seven now. That's what we're talking about. Come on. Let's get three from this. Nah. No way near. Eight for eight now. Oh, what a shot. Come on. We can get two. We'll probably get three. We're going to be into double figures, everyone. Brilliant. Brilliant stuff. I'm going to come back for two. Good running. Good running. You know, we might actually get something yes. more than ten all out. <laughs> Come on, run again. Stupid idiots. Can we get to twenty? Sixteen. Good running. Come on. No. Boo. Yes. Oh no, what's he doing? Oh, that's out. Got one more wicket. Come on. Oh, it's over the ropes. For four. We've got our first boundary, everyone. Hey, look at that. Would you look at that? Absolutely fabulous shot there. Oh, what a, what a direct hit. And that is it. 20 all out. It has to be said, we were pretty damn rubbish. But, um, you know, at least we learned how to play probably once it was too late. Nothing said from Richie Benno and David Gower at the end of the match. But all I've got to say is if you've enjoyed that, make sure you leave a like down below. It really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe to the channel for regular retro content. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.